Hey, uh, what's going on guys? Uh, welcome to my uh, new kitchen, I guess. Uh, today I'm gonna be making some food. You may be wondering what the rest of the apartment looks like. Well, you guys are gonna have to wait cause it's not ready yet. But the kitchen is, uh, so we're gonna make some food. Uh, what? I don't know yet. Uh, I'm just gonna look over the family recipes here and see if anything sounds good and as not too much food. <sighs> not feeling lasagna. Nope. Oh no. Ah, no, that's that's too collagey. Maybe. We'll put that in the maybe pile. This another time for sure. Maybe. <laughs> Jesus. No thing. Go. Egg mac and cheese. Nope. Classic cheese. No. No. Well, I wish I could make this, but I can't buy beer yet, so. Guess I'm not making that. Is this the last? Oh, one more. All right. All right, I have come up with five different possible ideas. We've got chicken garlic bread pizza. That one's really easy. Uh, but I don't really think I want to make that. That seems too like, eh. El Dorado casserole. That's just like a Dorito casserole. It's pretty good. But I don't know if I want to eat that right now. Because, oh lord, it's a lot and it's too good. Haley Sliders. Uh, shout out to my boy Sam and his family for giving us this recipe. It's pretty decent, pretty decent. Uh, meatloaf. <sighs> or porcupine meatballs, another Haley family recipe. I have no idea. I have no idea. I kind of really want to make this, but it's, mm, you know what? Fuck it, we're gonna make it, because I bet you guys don't even know what it's like. This is gonna get those views, those Dorito views. With something as mainstream as that. All right. Now it's just time to go to the grocery store, I guess. After I check what we have. I don't think we have garlic salt. Uh, we. I. Fuck you. You're not here. I have garlic powder. Do I have garlic salt though? I do have garlic salt. All right, now it's uh, time to go to the store. Uh, I'll be back with the ingredients. So far, I only have one thing. Um, Jesus, who died? Oh. Weird. Wow, that's big. It's crowded in there. Oh, oh, I'm recording. Huh. Well, that's awkward. All right, so I might have run into my first hurdle uh, already. I don't have a pan to brown the beef in. All I have is this uh, pot. So I guess I'm gonna have to wash this, unless I wanna use this, but I don't think this is gonna be big enough for, uh, nah. Oh, let's not do that. I guess we're gonna make it in a pot. I think I've got everything. Oh, I hated that. I hated that sound. Oh, it's so gross. Why is it a cube? Why can't you just make it a lump like everywhere else? Why you gotta make it a fucking block of meat? All right, onion time. How much? A uh, tablespoon, so not that much. Let's cut that top off. We we'll eat this in the trash. Mm -hmm. Oh, now this is definitely gonna be enough for a tablespoon, I feel like. All right, 
think this is enough onion. But first, I still have to brown the beef, which I am doing. We're going to start by sliding all of our onions in here. Let's go. That nice and oniony, as like the professionals say. Uh, we need a half teaspoon of garlic salt, so two, two pinches, I guess. And then we are going to need, holy shit, that's a lot of Doritos. That's for later. All of the tomato sauce, I guess. Just yeet your pizza sauce that you got because you couldn't find any tomato sauce. Uh, and you figure it'd probably taste all right. In a separate bowl, add cottage cheese, which we need, what a cup it says? I'd say this is about a cup. How much sour cream? A cup? Sheesh! Crushed Doritos, I can... I can do that. Look at this. Butter out the wazoo. So we put it on there. Uh, I forgot, I have to preheat the oven. Sweet. This is looking okay. All right, you just pour it all over. I can't, you guys can't see well, huh? Bread, that meat sauce on the top. <laughs> Those Doritos, do not shame me, please. Who doesn't want to know how to make a Dorito casserole? I mean, think about the views. All right, this is probably enough in here. Now we move on to grated cheese. All right, let's get a little bit more on here. What's next, is it chip next? It's chip next, right? Chip next. Honestly, you might not want to use all of them uh, if you want to be healthier. All right, let's get our meat sauce on here. Nice and semi-evenly, I guess. Now it's just the rest of the sour cream and then some more cheese on the top. Get a nice even coating of the cheddar cheese. This is gonna last a while. Um, it's a lot of food. It's a pound of beef in here. Uh, so keep that in mind. And it's got a lot of Doritos, so keep that in mind too. Um, but hey, it, it actually tastes really good. So don't knock it till you try it. Uh, obviously I would say don't have this every night. I maybe have this like once a year tops. <laughs> all right, so uh, once you have it all layered and stuff, this is what it's gonna look like in the pan. Uh, yeah, this is the El Dorado casserole. We're gonna put it in the oven at 350 for about 35 minutes. I'd say keep an eye on it. Um, yeah, so uh, here we go. I'm just gonna put it in there and I'll be back once, I guess in 35 minutes, once this Fucking thing is cooked. How do I start the timer? Ah, shit, I didn't really realize how much of that got on me. Damn, that sucks. I just got this shirt. Shout out to uh, Mogul Moves. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me a second. I'm dabbing right now. It has been 35 minutes, guys. There we go. That looks pretty beautiful. Uh, this is what it looks like uh, once all made. Here you can see uh, the different layers, I guess. So there it is, the different layers. And this is, this is what it looks like um, with Samsung's color filtering. All right, here we go. Yep, that's uh, that's El Dorado casserole. It's pretty good. I, I'd say try it. All right, I'm, I'm just gonna have to save this for like food for like the next week and like mix it up with some other stuff too. Cause that is a lot of food and you know, I'm gonna get my bang for my buck. Anyways, uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, like I said, it's pretty good. Um, I wouldn't have it all the time, like I said. 
Uh, but yeah, once in a while, it, it's, it's okay. It's not too bad. If you want to give it a try, give it a try. I'll post like the recipe in the description, maybe, if I remember. Uh, if you guys enjoyed that, uh, stick around. I plan to do more cooking videos in the future. Uh, if you have any video ideas, be it cooking or anything else, let me know. And I'll see you in the next video. See ya!